Welcome to Saturday Night Vespers, friends. As we enter into this time together, let us prepare our hearts and minds with three deep cleansing breaths. Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him belong, they are weak, but he is strong. Yes, Jesus loves me, yes, Jesus loves me, yes, Jesus loves me. The Bible tells me so. Psalm 71. In you, O Lord, I have taken refuge. Let me never be put to shame. Rescue me and deliver me in your righteousness. Turn your ear to me and save me. Be my rock of refuge, of which I can always go. Give the command to save me, for you are my rock and my fortress. Deliver me, O oh my God, from the hand of the wicked, from the grasp of evil and cruel men. For you have been my hope, O oh sovereign Lord, my confidence since my youth. From birth I have relied on you. You brought me forth from my mother's womb. I will ever praise you. I have become like a potent to many, but you are my strong refuge. My mouth is filled with your praise, declaring your splendor all the day long. Do not cast me away when I am old. Do not forsake me when my strength is failing. For my enemies speak against me. Those who will wait to kill me conspire together. They say God has forsaken him. Pursue him and seize him for no one will rescue him. Be not far from me, O oh God. Come quickly, O oh my God, to help me. Acts chapter 4, starting at verse 23. On their release, Peter and John went back to their own peoples and reported all that the chief priests and elders had said to them. When they heard this, they raised their voices together in prayer to God, Sovereign Lord, they said, You made the heaven and earth and sea and everything in them. You spoke by the Holy Spirit through the mouth of your servant, our father David. Why do nations rage and the peoples plot in vain? The kings of earth take their stand and rulers gather together against the Lord, against his anointed one. Indeed, Herod and Pontius Pilate met together with the Gentiles and the people of Israel in the city to conspire against your Holy Spirit, Jesus, whom you appointed. They did what your power and will had decided beforehand should happen. Now, Lord, consider these threats and enable your servants to speak your word with great boldness. Stretch out your hand to heal and perform miraculous sights and wonders in the name of your Son and your Holy Spirit, Jesus. After they prayed, the place where they were meeting was shaken, and they were filled with the Holy Spirit and spoke the word of God boldly. Thank you for joining me for Vespers tonight. I have loved this time together. Now, let us end in prayer by repeating after me. Dear God, thank you for this day. Watch over me as I sleep and help me to be your child tomorrow. In your name we pray, amen. Sleep tight, friends.